Well, decided to go to Baltimore Harley Davidson. We are doing a test ride. And because of the music, I'm not going to record much. Thanks for watching Dark Dave Shop. that my audio did not take so I will go ahead and talk to you guys while this is going um, biggest thing I have to say is it is a really small bike for a guy over 6'6 six, six. Um, for me I'm 6'4 I'm a bit on the heavy side so this bike's really small um, it is comfortable though I have four pegs on it and I was very happy with it I could have used a back rest because I have a bad back and I'm so used to hill toe shifting that it took me a few seconds to get used to it. I'm sorry that I only have the uh, one camera and here it dawned on me my other camera wasn't working and I'm like, okay let me give you a little taste of what we were seeing and it really just a test ride. You guys have gone on test rides they're pretty fun but it's one of those hey let's experience it. Now, for the Glide that I was on, the Sport Glide, it is a fun vehicle. It seems to be missing something from me. I'm very used to having a windscreen, as I just pointed out there. And it made it so my audio is just atrocious, so that's why I'm doing this audio. I normally don't voice over. I normally have my audio. And yes, we were doing the hand signals. And... I love my tri-glide, but it is fun getting on two wheels from time to time and having fun with group rides. Hopefully you guys enjoy it. Please don't forget to subscribe, like, and share. And if you're not a subscriber already, why not? If you are a subscriber, let me know what you think about some of these videos. I'm trying to do some more fun things, and the more it gets, the more fun things I can do. Instead of just running back and forth to work or, you know, going to grab something for myself. I'm hoping you guys are enjoying these as much as I am making them. And I'm thinking Wednesday is probably going to be my last Wednesday ride. But you never know. I mean, yes, I'm still going to ride, but I'm probably not going to do any more videos of it. So, let's get back to the bike here. Okay, now she shifts very smoothly. Now, yes, yeah, she is a new bike, but these are bikes that are being used for the demo days, so they do have, you know, a number of miles on them already, and God knows how many people have overshifted or missed shift, but she was a very smooth shifter. She has a lot of power for the size she is. Um, I thought with that small of an engine, it still had a lot of get-up-and-go. I'm used to my trike, which has a larger engine, 
because this is a 107 and I'm used to a 114 and I'm just like yeah I really felt the difference I felt I really had to put on to get her going and she had plenty of power she doesn't have a communication systems on her like some of the nicer upgrade bikes but not everybody's looking for that if you're looking for something to get around town and have some fun this is a great bike for it um, if you're a newer rider this is something I think would be fun for you I don't th I mean yeah a lot of older riders would probably like this too because it is very light and nimble I was able to get around very quickly and it's very fun to ride as I said, for me, one of the biggest things, it needs a backrest. And I prefer a hill toe, but I could live with the toe. Just need different boots for that particular function for this bike. I could easily read all of the gauges. They are a little low for, you know, my desire. But they're easily read, and you can see them pretty well. I know a lot of people like different type gauges, but these are right there on the tank. And yes, I had to stand up and adjust because, well, I'm ready without a back arrest. <laughs> and I know that I don't talk as much as some people on some of these, or I over talk, I'm not sure. But I'm hoping you guys like this and that you guys have a blast. Please go out to demo days when they have them, whatever your Harley dealer is. If you're in the Maryland area, just let them know Dark Dave sent you doesn't mean I'm going to get you anything because I don't get discounts for it except for my military discount. But it all is something fun and enjoyable. Hopefully you guys had a blast watching this. And let me know what you think. Give me some comments, some feedback. I'll figure out why my other camera didn't work. I'm pretty sure it's because I probably had it in photo instead of video. It happens because I was trying to take some stills earlier and with everything going on, I was like, yeah, those are not as good as I'd like. So here we are back at the dealership. And we're driving up. And hopefully my audio will be heard here in a minute, but I'm going to keep it low for a little bit because the band is playing. But this bike was really fun to get in there. And it was a nice day. Huge amount of people there. And after all of our time around, it seemed to be just fun. We really enjoyed it. Well, thank you guys very much, and hopefully we hear from you, and you guys have a blast. And for a guy with bad knees and a bad back, I'm very easily able to maneuver this bike around, so I know you guys can do that as well. Have a great time. Always ride safely. Give your friends and neighbors a hello and get out and ride. Start Dave shot. Hopefully you guys enjoyed that ride. This is the street glide. Let me do a real quick walk around on it. Of course you got the pop up. Got a nice bag, something in it. As you can see there's plenty of room in there. It's got a hydraulic. Locks down.